Good day guys and welcome back to another video, this time from my office back in Norway after spending 6 weeks in Hawaii to test out different items and gears and products that I was sent prior to this uh, trip and also to have a vacation and to explore more of Hawaii. So it's been the best vacation so far, I must say it's been the best vacation and it's definitely something for the books when it comes to Philip, I mean he's seen sharks, dolphins, big waves turtles he's been sitting on a paddleboard and i think sitting on the paddleboard was one of his favorite things to do because i was hearing it every single day let's go to the ocean let's paddle let's look for sharks let's look for turtles let's look at the fish so i think he had a very good time and I'm happy about that and we were bonding a little bit more because the trip was turning out to be a little bit different there's a video down in the description below if you want to check out that which is related to our our trip and how everything turned out a little bit different than we expected now one of the things that a lot of you have been asking about and I've got a lot of emails and DMS on Instagram especially is the tutorials LumaFusion tutorials why I haven't made any LumaFusion tutorials in months and it's been like forever yeah I know it's been like forever so did I actually quit LumaFusion or is there a reason why I haven't made any tutorials lately? So at a point I was actually considering quitting Aluma Fusion because of no updates and it takes forever between each update and things we were promised ages ago, it feels like, is still not there. But there is a reason for that and the reason is always the same, it's that Things are being developed, Luma Touch is a smaller team, so it takes longer to produce the different features that we will see in the future. But I was actually on the fence of quitting Luma Fusion for Final Cut Pro or Premiere Pro. I think if I should have done the full swap, I would go over and back to Premiere Pro because it's linked to After Effects and we can, you know, the connection there is a little bit more convenient uh, and then the connection between Final Cut Pro and Motion 5. I hate Motion 5, it's the worst program ever. So so I can't really see myself using that anytime in the future. Thank God it was cheap and not expensive. I got it off on sale, I don't know, 20, 20 bucks or something. Anyway, but I didn't really quit LumaFusion. I've always stuck to LumaFusion as my main editing um, platform. In the future, I might do more Premiere Pro, Final Cut Pro, whatever, DaVinci Resolve, I might try that even. Because even though I'm a beta tester, I know which updates are coming and it's it's you know it's gonna be insane i think most of the people which are you know quit luma fusion to go over to final cut pro i think those people will you know quit final cut pro and come back to luma fusion once we have these updates i'm gonna make a separate video on that where i talk a little bit more about the updates and when we can expect them to be released uh, i think that video is coming in in a couple of days a couple of days uh, so yeah, I did consider quitting LumaFusion, but the reason why I haven't made any uh, tutorials lately is first, we have been on a six weeks vacation in Hawaii, which has been amazing. And the other thing is that I got to a point where I was putting more effort into trying to figure out what to make. And the things that I tried to make, it got harder and harder and it wasn't, I've always said, you know, I've always said that anything is possible, but yeah, anything is possible to a certain point. So the things I were trying to make wasn't really possible. I got to a point where I couldn't get any further because of limitations. It basically skew 3D and, and those basic things. Things. So I spent more time trying to figure out how to do, you know, the end section of the the effect that I tried to make and I was stuck for days. So I wanted to do something different. I wanted to, you know, reset my brain and make different videos, videos that I really wanted to make uh, and uh, informal motivational videos and uh, other review videos and then just, you know, simple hikes and travel videos. And by doing that, I also learn new things myself, uh, things I have to figure out on the way. When I do that, that's also going to generate more tutorials for the future. So there will be a lot of tutorials coming soon. Now, like I said, there is a new update coming very soon as well. I'm going to keep that for a different video. This is going to be a short one and I can see it's dragging out now but anyway 
that's one of the reasons that I haven't made any tutorials. I have a list of, I think it's 20 tutorials, which is ready to be made. Uh, it's just that I now need to gather two terabytes of footage, which I have from Hawaii, and it's on six or seven different cameras. So I need to categorize them and, and place them in orders and, you know, find out which is from which location and just make a system on that first. So there's going to be a lot of color grading uh, things and tips on that part for LumaFusion coming soon. We gonna have scopes yes and we're gonna have a very very nice feature which is uh, it's gonna be your favorite feature for sure and we're gonna come back to that very very soon two days i reckon we're gonna come back to that but yeah that's basically why i haven't made any tutorials uh in a couple of months i guess and also of course the mini 3 came and it's like the perfect drone it's it's my favorite, just, you know, every single drone that I had for every single release, the new drone has been on the top and on the top, on the top. But, you know, this Mini 3 just washed out every single prior drone that I had. So stay tuned for that review as well, coming pretty soon. Now, that's gonna be the end for today. I gotta go uh, have a meeting. So I will be seeing you in the next video, I guess. A quick update on why I haven't been mating 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 why i haven't been mating wow why i haven't been making any luma fusion tutorials but it's getting there and i uh, might be changing it up having two separate channels one which is pure tutorial and one which is you know all the random things or cinematic videos or the output from the I don't know, I don't know. Any suggestions down in the comment section below would be appreciated. Let me know how are you spending your summer as well down in the comment section below. Have you been taking a trip? Are you going on a trip? Are you in Spain like every other Norwegian person here? Or what are your plans for this summer? That's gonna be the end for today. Really hope that you got some uh, value from this video and understand that I, you know, can't push the videos all the time, so. Uh, that's uh yeah yes i will see you in the next video